Most of us just need a room with a view. You don't need the whole thing, you need a perspective. And when you've got that perspective, if you've got the drive and energy, you can really make a difference. University of Pretoria's Gordon Institute of Business Science has been making a difference to the careers of thousands of executives and their companies since it opened its doors in January 2000. In the words of its MBA alumni, The way it changed my career was it made everything relevant. It almost changed the critical path and direction with my life followed. In, in essence, it allowed me to focus and continue on my business um, and, and build and grow my enterprise. So it shifted perspectives in terms of what our role is. So whether you're in a large corporate or running your own business, you're now looking at the bigger perspective and looking at the strategic impact that you have. The unique learning environment at Gibbs has positively impacted not only its alumni, but the fortunes of the companies they lead or work for. In South Africa, we're facing a lot of challenges. How do we play globally? How do we actually um, improve ourselves? And how do we actually work effectively as a country? South Africa's economic landscape has never been more competitive. Dealing effectively with the challenges and opportunities facing us is vital if we are to succeed in this fast-changing business environment. So, does a business education give you a return on your investment? Succeeding in business is not an average task. For me, the question is not so much whether you need a business education. The question more specifically is what kind of business education do you need? The MBA will start to fashion your thoughts, help you, uh, I suppose, find your way in what is a very, very tricky environment. And the one outstanding feature of Gibbs for me is the trouble to which Gibbs goes to position all its learning within the context of the environment. A Master of Business Administration is one of the most sought-after qualifications in the marketplace and can be a life-changing experience for those with a clear sense of purpose and the ambition to make a significant difference to their careers, business and the country. But the main thing I think for me was actually growing my confidence as a business leader and recognising the role I play in a small business, but also in terms of the economy and working with different corporate clients. The promise of an MBA at Gibbs was about the best academic and real work experience that I could get. This is the value of a Gibbs MBA in broadening one's understanding of the interconnectedness of, of, of different aspects of, of business. Strategic insight and the ability to act decisively are critical to our effectiveness as managers, executives and leaders. Gibbs' commitment to the real-world nexus, which fosters this insight and decisiveness, has led to international accreditation in 2007 from AMBA. In 2008, Gibbs made the Financial Times' global list of top 40 business schools for executive education for the fifth consecutive year. What differentiates Gibbs um, is our total commitment to anchor what we do in practice, in the business community, to actually make sure that we are offering a service that the business community would pay money for, would want, um, would value. It isn't just an ivory tower on a hill, but it is very much uh, aligned with what business is, uh, uh, is going through and what business executives are worrying about. And, and that keeps it fresh. And the core Gibbs philosophy, to be close to business, is manifest everywhere from its location in the heart of Santon, the business hub, to its interaction with its leaders, its forums and academic programs. But it was about an environment where you were talking to other business people and their interaction with other business people rather than a purely academic environment. The information centre gets 1.6 million hits a year. Proof enough that the emerging practice of lifelong learning helps business executives cope with the faster pace, growing complexity and higher stakes of the world of business. I think what Gibbs gives you is portable skills through the power of knowledge and through the power of learning how to create your own next practices as we like to call it here. So it's the best practice but it's one that actually is customized for your environment. At Gibbs the MBA course is mainly live action. Case studies are tackled in solving business problems. Students debate and defend their point of view. Learning how to make decisions. And action learning is about taking a simulated environment and, and actually forcing you to make a decision. And as a leader and as a business person, you have to be able to make tough decisions, sometimes the wrong ones, um, but in, in that is often the best learning. The MBA is firstly a partnership with the student, but it's broader than that. It's a partnership 
with the organization. And so it's real-time learning. It's a blended learning approach. And that's rich because you're not waiting to put this into practice two years down the line, but it's immediate. So is branding an outside-in process that we start with customers? Or is branding an inside-out process? And the value of real-time learning is accentuated by faculty who are part of the cut and thrust of the business world. So I bring that sense of reality. By bringing work experience, what I bring is a living, breathing case study. The Gibbs NBA experience goes beyond the campus and the borders of South Africa. It encompasses best business practice found in the global giants of the West and the emerging Eastern economies. I think to sum it up in one word, it's, it's exposure. It's exposure to a new global economy which they previously don't have exposure to. It's new learnings, it's new business strategies, it's new national development strategies by countries, by regions. Whether you're going to a developing economy in Asia or a developed economy like the US where we go, uh, it's really about understanding how great companies around the world are doing what they do. Whether the focus is on innovation and technology in Silicon Valley or Shanghai, or the extraordinary success of the IT industry in India, seeing is believing. India is wonderful if you go down to Bangalore or even north up to Mumbai and to see how sometimes low-tech, sometimes high-tech, uh, they're able to do things so much faster, so much better than we're able to do or than the Americans are able to do. Understanding the politics, the economy, the culture and engaging with people creates the total experience. How better to understand the emerging economies than going to Mumbai and seeing the juxtaposition of the have and have not. A business school, if you're significantly involved with it as an executive, should be a turning point in your life. Like Kennedy Bungani, whose career was fast-tracked directly through his MBA. His final thesis so impressed his employer that he was asked to implement it. Now, that was interesting, because um, uh, I then uh, started this new small project within the bank, and it became so successful. And I must admit, uh, became my first um, claim to fame at Standard Bank. Kennedy is one of many Gibbs graduates whose life path has been changed. Sometimes it's a radical step in a new direction. Sometimes it's a simple tweak in your confidence, your network, your skills base. I guess it gives you scope, it gives you a broad understanding of all the aspects of business so that you can have the debate with the IT guy, with the CEO, with the level of confidence that you understand the basic vocabulary and the basic concepts um, of business around that. Here I think what makes it really different is about the practice, how great organizations, how great managers do what they do that move the organization forward. But perhaps the true value of the Gibbs MBA experience goes beyond the usual boundaries of traditional business schools. It's the path to learning about yourself. The MBA gave you obviously business fundamentals, but I think more importantly life fundamentals. I mean the friendships that I made and the learning about self and the journey towards to becoming a good leader was absolutely crucial in terms of changing life.